Hello guys, it's Pinky Beats and welcome to my channel. Today, my cousin and I and her cousin will be going to Comic Con. Hope you guys enjoy the vlog and please stay tuned. Just, my phone's camera quality is so bad. Oh. Say hello, Tyler. Hi. <laughs> There's a dude in a maid costume. Yes! It's what we look for. What's going on? Uh, the line is just Oh, I see. So, yeah, no, there's a girl. Oh, which is Thing. Her name is Thing. She's a spoken maid. Wait, her song is spoken. It's a stunt dog. Oh, she's a stick. That's the thing. Yes, that's the thing. Can I take a video of you being excited? Are you sure? <laughs> Hello, Tyler.
Is this the one in Rainbow? I mean, it's two. Uh, we have Rainbow, Kailami, we have a bunch. Yeah. This is where I was going to buy the first two. Real swords, we have blunt swords and we have bamboo swords. The real swords are on display, I think the bottom three. Okay. Uh, I think the, the real ones are underneath there. I finally made it home after the event we went to my aunt's place and my family had like some get together a bride and they were just having a fun time so I was like I'm not doing the ending of my video there I'll just wait till we get home so it's the following day but anyway um Comic Con was such a great event guys um I really enjoyed myself I felt so free I had so much fun just seeing everyone dress up like I said this to my cousin on our way home this like the vibes at Comic Con felt like the vibes like if you had to go to a music festival um, you just feel at ease you feel comfortable you're having fun you're not worried you know because that's what I enjoyed about Comic Con I did not think too much I was just experience like enjoying the experience and enjoying what I saw um, we went and bought stuff for us. I bought a poster of Zorro from One Piece. I wish I got like, I saw like this beautiful poster of Goku from Dragon Ball and I just was like, when I saw it, I was like, yo, that would look good in my room because of the blue with the gray, it just would look good. But I only had like a 500 and that was like two, 350 and I was like, yo. I'm going for Zoro. Another thing was, like I, like normally, I go to these events, but I also sometimes feel very uncomfortable with this event. I did not feel like claustrophobic a bit, or I did, I didn't feel overwhelmed. That's what I'm trying to say. I didn't feel overwhelmed because it, it wasn't as, it wasn't squashed. Um, I did get lost a bit because like we were walking fast, but. I wasn't worried because I was like, I'm kind of fine. I'm not saying it's like that safe, but I, I did feel safe. Um, but yeah, and I just saw today that my one friend actually went to today's one, which is the 24th, I went on the 23rd. And I was like, yo, like why didn't she go on the same day I went? It would have been so nice if we like bumped into each other. We haven't seen each other in a long time. And I actually liked the outfit she dressed up as like, I don't know, I think, as a cat woman. Yeah, she dressed up as a woman and yeah, she looked good and she looked like she had fun. So yeah, I really wish I bumped into her. But anyway, um, it, the event was great. I enjoyed myself. Uh, this is not the first Comic Con I've been to. I've been to Comic Con in 2016, but that one was like at the Coca-Cola Dome and this one was in the South. And this one was also bigger. At the Coca-Cola Dome, you're in that room, and I remember just like my sinuses are bad, so I kind of wanted to leave the room, like leave this building all the time because it just felt too packed and people were on top of each other. Whereas this year they were at like some place in the south and there were three halls, so and a place outside, so people were walking up and down. There was like it felt it was spacious. That's like that's why I didn't feel like people were on top of me. I just felt like I was free and I, I was it's like walking in a field basically, that's what I'm trying to say. But anyway, um I would definitely go back to Comic Con for a third time. I think this time the next time next time I would dress up. I promised my cousin Tyler that I would dress up because she kind of was like why did she dress up and I was like what am I gonna dress up as? And I kind of forgot about this event a bit, uh, but next year I promise to dress up whatever she wants us to dress up as because I feel like we need to match. I like that's one thing I liked about what I saw. People were like matching the groups. That was nice. Um, but anyway, guys, thank you so much for 
watching the video please do like comment and subscribe click the notification bell and i will see you next time